The first rule at surviving your office party is to show up. Be on time, have a smile, have a great story, and a decent outfit. I know you may be tempted to show off your fabulousness, but you have five seconds to make a first impression. Aim for holiday chic and not Santa's little hussy. Guys, come on, take a little effort. Tuck your shirt in, you know your boss is watching. Now that you've shown up in the right outfit, assign yourself a wingman. That could be your spouse, a friend, or a coworker. A wingman's duty is to watch your back. They make sure that nobody spends too much time talking to just one person. Can I borrow you for a second? Cuts off drinks if necessary. And make sure that you get to meet every single person that you need to meet at the party. You can drink, only if you can handle it. I know it's free, but stick to two drinks. Don't get drunk. Cut your alcohol with water, juice, or lots of ice. And no drinking on an empty stomach. But Jensen said he wants it in an XL, and I just don't have time for that. You know, that's my whole week. No way. Nobody wants to hear about your 50-page report at a holiday office party. Showcase your dazzling personality. Compliment and ask questions of the people you come in touch with. Machines network, humans talk. Keep your conversation to a simple, meaningful chat, which creates a nice vibe, or a hum between two people. Parties allow you to talk to anyone. Introduce yourself to senior people. Before you speak to somebody important at the holiday party, do yourself a favor. Go find out what their hobbies or interests are. You know, I just started taking this class on knitting down at the local craft center, and it's an amazing class. Oh my goodness. I love knitting. You love to knit? I'm working on an afghan right now. Oh my now. god, that's so amazing. How did you... So I was like, where the f*** am I? Next thing I know, I got this little f***ing alien dude about to shove a big metal rod up my... Don't swear at a holiday party, and don't talk about things that could really question your mental stability. If all else fails, give the compliment. Congratulations on you finishing the marathon. Such a rush, man. You gotta try it someday. Dude, I can't. I got a metal rod on my Okay, so you made your rounds, said hello to all the right people, spent five to eight minutes with each of them, and you're having a great time. If you make out with anyone, you're on your own. Just know it'll be all over Facebook forever. Holiday parties can be safe and fun. Just remember, be on time, dress appropriately, make sure you have a smile and a great story, assign yourself a wingman, no making out, no swearing, chat and hum, and leave when things are still going well. I'm Jocelyn Greenkey. Check back for another episode of The Politics of Everything.